you amazing beautiful people and uh, welcome back to another anime reaction video this is one well this is one that i'm pretty excited for the naruto osts are notorious in the anime world everyone's been telling me naruto osts are one of the best osts in the gang and a lot of you have been asking me to check out a few more of them which is exactly what we're going to do today with the most requested from all of you which is sadness and sorrow so i'm gonna go into this one completely blind this is my genuine first time reaction never hearing this ost before and I'm excited to find a ticket off my list. Let me know what other animes I should be reacting to, what other anime OSTs you'd like me to react to, and what animes you think you want to see me watch on this channel as well, because there's a few animes I would like to watch as well in the future. Put all your recommendations in the comment section down below, and make sure you guys subscribe if you want more reactions like this. But enough of my talking. Let's jump into my first time ever reaction to Naruto OST, Sadness and Sorrow. just of this opening i i'm guessing we're in for like an emotional instrumental journey i mean the song is literally called sadness and sorrow so i think it's going to be quite emotional just based on that title the song is literally called sadness and sorrow it's just saying <laughs> This feels like an OST that plays when something heartbreaking happens. The thing is, Naruto, to me, doesn't feel like an anime that has these kind of moments in it, right? It, it Just from the, an outsider's perspective, it feels like a, quite a light-hearted, fun journey about um, just following this, this the main character's story, right? Naruto, following his story in uh, becoming like a better warrior. That just feels what it is. It feels quite light-hearted. Light but I may be completely wrong. I've been wrong a lot of times before. Maybe Naruto is a lot darker than I'm giving it credit for. the creation of music the amount of effort they put into every single song you listen to the amount of different instruments the, literally every song feels like a live orchestral performance every single time and the naruto osts are literally notorious for this everyone in the anime community tells me they're one of the best in the game and already i can see why they're so good so much beauty in this so much emotion in this Also, simple question, would I enjoy Naruto? Do you guys think I would enjoy this anime? Also, I am pausing quite a lot more in this reaction because the copyright around Naruto is quite tough in terms of these songs. So I'm trying to avoid it having to get audio blocked. So I got to chop it up. So I am pausing a little bit and rewinding and stuff like that. Hopefully you guys don't mind. But yeah, I am curious, would I enjoy Naruto? I 
find so interesting whenever I record these OST reactions I always love reading the comments section and seeing what all of you talk about because I don't know what scene unfolds when this OST is playing um, but you guys obviously do so the emotions you guys are feeling are going to be 10 times what I'm feeling and I find that so interesting it's really interesting whenever I listen to these OSTs I always really want to see the scenes that unfold when they're going on and this one sounds like a heartbreaking one So, absolutely, simply beautiful. Really, really was. Like, just a simply beautiful song. Something I just didn't, something I just don't expect from Naruto. Like, I don't know anything about Naruto, if I'm being perfectly honest, right? The same way I go into all anime reactions I do on this channel blind, I don't do any background research. I do my best to avoid spoilers and finding out anything about the story because... I want to do a lot of genuine first time reactions. I love the idea of this channel being a like a guide where you can literally see a guy who had no interest in ever watching anime, could not give a crap about anime, didn't think he was going to like anime, and then being introduced to this world and getting used to it. I want this channel to showcase that journey and I'm doing my best to make sure it does and, and does it like fairly. And like you guys can see that, you can see the timeline of someone who didn't care about anime day one to now. And... Um, so I do my best to avoid knowing more about animes than other than their basic storylines, uh, so I can go into them blind. And Naruto, I, maybe I'm being wrong here, because I'm saying in my head I never expected this sort of OST from Naruto, which means I've already in my head somehow formulated what I think this anime is about, without actually knowing anything about it. Um, I think that's probably that probably comes from the fact that Naruto is so big. Like it's one of before I ever began a reaction to anime. There was a few animes I knew the name of. Naruto was one of them, right? The Naruto run is famous. Um, a bunch of YouTubers I follow are huge Naruto fans as well, so they used to talk about it. It's an incredibly popular anime. A lot of people know. Everyone knows about the headband. I believe a lot of FaZe Clan members uh, know Naruto. I mean, even in the Misfits boxing scene, flipping um, FaZe Temper walks out with a Naruto headband. So there's like a lot of... It's, it's, it's very, like, known Naruto. So it was a name I, I knew... And in my head, I just assumed it was quite, and I still do, quite a, like, younger, light-hearted, easier-to-watch kind of anime. That makes sense. But the more I seem to discover, the more I, the more I seem to discover in the world of anime, the more I realize how wrong I am. So many times when it comes to anime, it's like, I get an idea of what I think it's going to be about in my head. And I'm just always proven wrong. I'm always shown this like completely different side of this anime, this like really emotional dark side. And I even see it with shows like like that time I got reincarnated as a slime, right? Um, we did a watch through of that series and it's very light, very fun, very enjoyable. But man, there are some episodes just slotted in there that are just devastatingly heartbreaking, like bring tears to your eyes immediately. And it's so just random. And it just goes to show how much range there is in a lot of these animes and how something like naruto in my head i'm thinking it's going to be like light-hearted and fun and i listen to an ost like sadness and sorrow and then in my head i'm thinking this is gonna be this is gonna hit me sometimes i am interested those of you who have seen all of naruto is it something you think i would enjoy uh is it something you guys would like me to watch i did say if the channel keeps growing in subscribers i will watch a giant anime um which i'll let you guys vote for um we're still growing but we're slowing down a little bit so i don't know if you guys actually want that um but yeah the more subscribers this channel gets the more content i will push towards what you guys want if that makes sense um so the bigger i see this channel growing the more i know you guys want certain stuff and the more you guys get that certain stuff if that makes sense so if you guys would like me to watch naruto which i would be very curious about then i've got to know you guys want want me to like you guys want to join me on that journey um, because this is definitely an anime I've heard so much about and an anime I would like to know like is this going to break me down emotionally is this a hard hitting anime is it just a fun ride of an anime am I just going to enjoy every single step of the way and what the hell is the OSTs all about why are they so brilliantly done I need to react to some more Naruto OSTs I think what's another one you guys want me to check out because if the rest of them are like sadness and sorrow with this much love going into the instrumental 
I, I'm just going to keep reacting to these and be so curious to see what scene unfolds with this OST player. Anyway, I hope you guys all enjoyed this reaction. I'll leave a link to the full song if you're going to listen to it without me pausing it in the description. Um, and let me know what other OSTs you want me to react to on this channel. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And as always, my friends, you will see you in the next video.